welcome back to the BC Boots UK YouTube channel and in today's video we have got four very special pairs of custom match worn Adidas Predators. Now these are from some of the very best midfielders of the modern era. We're going to be taking a look at the modifications in which they've made to their pairs over the standard ones and then we're going to be seeing if we can compare and spot any similarities between the four pairs. So then let's start off with this gold pair of Adidas Predator Addy Powers. Now this pair were match worn by the legend himself David Beckham. They were worn whilst playing for LA Galaxy and they do feature a number of modifications over the standard version of the Addy Power. So if we start off with the upper, Beckham's pair feature a patent leather upper rather than a synthetic material which he found on the retail version. We take a look at the personalisation on this pair, it's actually rather unique. So on the lateral side he has his squad number 23 and to the medial side he has his children's names, so Brooklyn, Romeo, Cruz and Harper. Now in terms of personalisation the most interesting part is the heel area. So the retail version of this model of Beckham boots had a large Adidas logo to the left boot and then the right boot featured his free kick logo. However Beckham's pair on the left boot features his David Beckham logo along with a smaller version of the Adidas logo and then above that he has the United States flag along with his DB initials there and V for Victoria. So if we take a look at the right boot as well we'll notice the exact same personalisation however the right boot features the England flag, the St George's Cross in replacement of the United States flag. Now the most interesting part of this personalisation is this Beckham logo here with the smaller Adidas logo. So obviously this was something that came out on the next model which was the blue and the green version of the Predator Alley Power, the Beckham colorway. Beckham was the only player that obviously got to wear these, um, well in, in terms of sponsored players. The Beckham logo here is in replacement of the free kick logo. So obviously this is something that is not available on the retail market. It's not something that was an option to the general public, they had to have the free kick logo there with the Adidas logo on the left. Beckham has also had added an additional lace hole both to the lateral side and the medial side and these are at the top of the lacing system. So this is just another um, addition in which Beckham's added to help him give, get the best lockdown and fit possible. In terms of them being custom made to measure, of course they were made to measure to Beckham's specifications. He was one of Adidas's top sponsored players, so of course they were catered to his needs to the very fine millimetre. So if we take a look at the lateral side, it's cut rather low in comparison to the medial side. It's a different heel cup shape and then the medial side has been made slightly higher. Now it is very typical of Beckham's boots of this era to have absolutely no size labels whatsoever and this pair are no different. So if we take a look here, not a single size label in sight. When we remove the insole however, you will notice that a number is written inside. So during this era, up until around 2012-13, to 13, Adidas wrote in an identification number in the heel area, just like this pair. This is when the internal size labels were different to the athlete services ones. So that is when they updated their size labels and then they stopped writing numbers in the heel. They instead started applying those um, sort of small sticker labels in the heels. In terms of sizing, Beckham's boots do measure to be around a UK 8.5, which is around a US 9. If we take a close look inside the boots, you'll notice the fourth report there. The large exclusion there is the lack of power spine. So if we take a look here, it states power spine on the sole plate, however, there is no cavity there whatsoever. That is just there for advertisement purposes. Beckham did not use this power spine in his boots, which is rather interesting because it's obviously something that he was advertising whilst using the boots, um, but it's not something that he used at all. Finally then, the last differences are the difference in the heel liner. 
So Beckham's boots feature a gold heel liner as opposed to a black one which you found on the retail version along with the stud tips here being gold as well. The retail version featured red stud tips. Okay, next up then we'll take a look at this pair of Adidas Predator Absolutes. And now this pair were match worn by our midfielder Xabi Alonso. Interestingly, he wore this pair spanning across two seasons, so the 2005 to 2006 and 2006 to 2007 seasons, whilst playing for Liverpool. He also wore this model at the 2006 FIFA World Cup during that summer. However, this pair are from his Liverpool time. So, in terms of differences over the standard retail version, this pair feature a totally different leather upper. It may not come across as well on camera, however, the, the suppleness and the, the sheer softness of the upper is just incredible. This same leather is used for the tongue, so you'll notice here that the difference in creasing is just it's a totally different leather, it's rather interesting really. In terms of personalisation, he has embroidered Alonso to the tongue, along with his squad number 14 to the heel. Now on the heel of the retail version, the Adidas logo was there. Now that was embossed. On Alonso's pair, that is not there at all. Instead he's got his numbers, uh, squad number 14, which is actually embroidered, rather than being embossed like the retail version's Adidas logo. If we take a look inside the boots, we'll remove the insole and you'll notice here that he actually uses the hard ground insoles rather than the firm ground. This would just be personal preference to the player. Quite interesting because they are obviously firm ground boots. Now then, on the underside of the insole, we'll notice here that the power pulse has actually been removed. It's not there at all. The insoles are that just, just quite literally removed. That is because the interior of the boots feature a custom insole board and then down inside there there is no power spine at all or power pulse rather sorry so if we take a look on the sole plate we'll notice here that it's a very sort of strange color that is just purely because it's been filled in and blocked off so the retail version featured that sort of sand um, gimmicky technology the players typically just did not use that. It wasn't something that they used at all. Um, many players obviously advertised that purely due to contractual reasons with Adidas, with their sponsorships. In terms of sizing, Xabi Alonso is also a UK 8.5. And we'll notice here the size label states sample made in Germany and then MTM. So MTM means made to measure. So this was what the size labels looked like from the Adidas Germany factory prior to that 2012 to 2013 changeover which I mentioned earlier in this video. So previously they did state sample on the size label and then underneath MTM it had 502001 which is as I mentioned in the Lionel Messi boots review video that is the factory number for the Adidas Germany factory where they make their top sponsored players boots. Okay, so next up then we'll take a look at this pair of Adidas Predator Power Swerves. Now this pair were not match worn, they were match issued to Michael Ballack. So he's the legendary mid German midfielder. These were issued to him during the 2007 to 2008 season whilst playing for Chelsea. Now you may have already noticed some differences straight off the bat with this pair. So the leather is just absolutely incredible throughout. It's totally different to the retail version. Just look at that creasing and it actually runs around the whole boot so you've got this vamp of leather here which runs all the way around the heel right up until the medial side of the boot so just take a look at that leather it's just ridiculous the level of quality there is just insane with personalization he has had embroidered to the tongues his children's names so Emilio Louis and Jordi in place of the Predator logo which is there on the standard version. So that Predator logo was printed onto the tongue. Obviously with Balak's pair featuring embroidery, they have made it without that printed um, Predator logo. And to the heel, similar to Xabi Alonso's pair, he has the squad number 13, which was his number at um, Chelsea, in place of that embossed Adidas logo. Moving on to the sole plate, this is where it gets interesting on Balak's pair. So he actually uses the Predator Absolute sole plate. So the heel is the same as the Power Swerve. However, the forefoot 
is from the absolute. This is reflected again with his insoles. So if we take a look here, you'll notice he's got the absolute insoles. They're actually from the firm ground version, which is interesting, but um, this is a Predator absolute insole. He does actually have that power pulse cavity. However, it is just, it is empty. It's just a hollow piece of plastic. It's not actually um, weighted or got any sand in it like what the retail version had. So that would just be to fill the gap which is left in the sole plate there. With Javi Alonso's pair he had that filled in, um, but with Balak's pair he really just had that left. This pair, again, sample made in Germany, made to measure, so again made to exact, his exact specifications and requirements, and Michael Balak's pair were a size UK 8, which is a US 8.5. Okay, so lastly then we'll move on to the final pair which we've got to review today, which is this pair of Adidas Predator Power Spurs. So the same model as Michael Balax, however this pair were match worn by, again, the legendary midfielder David Beckham. So this are his special limited edition colorway. Similar to the gold pair, this pair feature a patent leather upper rather than synthetic like the standard retail version. And you'll notice here that this pair feature a number of additional lines of stitching on the fourth of the upper. So take a look here, this is just literally line after line after line of stitching which runs all the way around. And then you've got additional lines here coming out from underneath the rubber power shooting elements. In terms of personalization, Beckham's got his children's name to the Power Swerve external field counter, Brooklyn Romeo Cruz, along with his squad number 23 there next to the American flag along with, again, his DB initials and V for Victoria. Similar to the gold pair then, he also has the England flag to the right boot, as opposed to the American flag. So, taking a further look at the boots, different, more differences to the retail version, Beckham's pair feature a massive tongue. This is huge, totally different to the retail version. The retail version's tongue was much smaller than this. The free kick logo of Beckham's is also bigger on the tongue. The retail version it was much smaller. Again, this pair feature no size labels at all. They were custom made to measure to Beckham's exact specifications and requirements. If we remove the insole, we'll notice here it is pretty much the same as the retail version. Again, however, he's got no power pulse cavity on the underside. So this pair feature a totally different insole board. It's rather um, thicker than the standard version, it actually, actually features a little bit more padding as well, hence the different colour. And you'll notice there, there's no slot for the power pulse cavity. Okay, that's all for our video today guys, thanks very much for watching this review. Let me know in the comments section below if you noticed any similarities between the four pairs in terms of the modifications. Did you expect there to be more modifications or less on these particular players' boots? Let me know in the comments below. Stay tuned for more content coming soon. We've got lots more match-worn and player-custom um, boot reviews coming your way. So see you in the next one.